Hi, I'm Tom from Rafters in Sheffield. I'm going to be cooking a spring menu from our debut cookbook, Pivot, in partnership with Grumwerg and Global Knives. Today we're going to be cooking one of our signature snacks, a ton of cheese tart with Sheffield honey. So today's ingredients that we're going to be using, uh, we've got some brick pastry for the tart case, uh, beautiful Tumworth cheese so from Hampshire, uh, we've got some butter, some beautiful eggs, so Arlington white eggs, so a really bright yolk, a little bit of rosemary and some Sheffield honey and then our local cream as well from Arkell Molly Dairy. For this recipe today we're going to be using the Global Cheese Knife and also the Global Herb Chopper as well. So first up we're going to make the brick pastry tarts. So first of all we need to preheat the oven to 170 degrees Celsius. Then we're going to take our brick pastry and stamp it out using a 70 millimeter cutter. We're going to melt the butter in a pan. So we're just going to melt that nicely and then brush that between the layers of pastry. So we want two layers per tart. Then we're going to press that into the tart case using a five centimeter tart case for this. And we've got these lovely global scissors here. So we're just going to use those to trim off the excess pastry. We're going to pop them in the oven and bake them for 10 minutes. And then what you're looking for is that beautiful golden brown colour when they come out. Next up we need to make the cheese mousse. So we're going to quickly dice our cheese using the global cheese knife. And then add it to a pan with our double cream from our cow molly. We're going to bring that to the boil and give it a good whisk. While it's coming to the boil we can separate our egg yolks. Put those into a bowl and then pass the cheese mix through a sieve over the top of the egg yolks and give them a good whisk together. Then we need to pour that into our siphon gun, charge it with a nitrous oxide cylinder. And then we've got the beautiful aerated cheese mousse. For the rosemary salt we need to strip the leaves from the stem and then add a good pinch of Malden sea salt and then using the global herb chopper we're going to chop that really finely and the great thing about the herb chopper is you can use it for scooping up that salt off the uh, chopping board at the end. When it comes to service we just need to pop the brick pastry tarts onto the plate and we're going to fill those up with the cheese mousse, the tum of cheese mousse that we've got in the cylinder. We're going to sprinkle the rosemary salt over the top and finish it with a beautiful drizzle of Sheffield honey and then they're ready to serve. We want to serve those straight away because they will drop after five minutes. So here we've got our signature snack which is a tum of cheese tart with Sheffield honey and a little rosemary salt which is the ideal way to start the meal.